Welcome back, my dear light bulbs, to another Ichi the Witch review. If you're new here to my channel, remember to subscribe to become part of the Light Bulb Army, as I will be covering this series on a weekly basis. Let's get right into it. Ah, uh, so Ichi the Witch still makes me really happy reading it. I just love the robe of Ichi the Witch. I like the characters, the Skaras, Ichi, even the introduction of the magic Raiko, who is a lightning magic, and he was born into the world, well, manifested, it didn't say born, well, born manifested, kind of, I would say it's kind of uh, the same thing, let me, let me see the definition manifest, display or show a quality or feeling by, I would say he was born into the world two weeks ago, a lightning magic, we still don't really know how magics are born into or let's say manifest or manifested into this world if they just randomly happen or too many magics died and another one has to be born who knows because there's over i believe one of the chapters said it's over four thousand magics currently in the world that they know of that they know of by the way and they know where they are and stuff so the only thing with this chapter is this was an easy takedown which hopefully not, I don't think every magic takedown is going to be easy like this. In the sense that, yes, I know E.G. prepped, he's a hunter, he observed Raikou for an entire day in its habitat, ob ob observed what Raikou did, which Raikou literally was killing all the animals around him, uh, around him for no reason because just for pure entertainment and we could see that because in the chapter Raikou literally says there's nothing like the smell of seared flesh and he's just happy about it and basically he's very boastful he's like okay i'm gonna okay i destroy all these animals i know there's a village nearby i'm gonna, I'm gonna go after the humans and he's just thinking all oh, the witches haven't come for me he's very cocky a very cocky magic and for good reason because this guy's trial is you have to steal the jewel that he has without getting hit by his lightning, right? However, it's hard not to get hit by his lightning because even a bird, right, flying all the way very high in the, sky, in the air got hit by its lightning, which is really cool. So I do like that Ichi used his hunting abilities to set a trap for Raiko and we learned that in this series basically you could infuse magic into items so that's very interesting as we saw later in the chapter that ichi and the scars infuse magic into the rope that ichi used to set the trap for raiko and i'm gonna assume that a lot of magics are gonna be like this they're gonna be very cocky I still believe that we will see a magic or humanoid magics, not now in the series, maybe way later on, right? Right now is just the very beginning. We're only three chapters in. Uh, it's slowly gonna build up and we're gonna see, we're gonna see some very powerful magics. And I give kudos to the creators of the series because there's two, an artist and uh, author, because to think every single week of a new type of monster to make, a new type of magic with new abilities, which that's gonna be a big task right there. So shout out and kudos to you uh, for that, for writing that, because I know that is not gonna be uh, easy, right? So far we've seen Uroro, second um, we've seen Raiko, and we'll see more later on. The comedy is still here in this chapter, so that's gonna be part of this manga, little comedy jabs here and there. The comedy for me is a hit or miss. I'm not saying the comedy in this manga is bad or anything, but so far for me, I'm not like laughing, like, oh, this is so hilarious and things like that. But I, I did like the scene, the panel, which was on page thir uh, 13 where they're uh, basically each is playing with Raikou's tail and then we see Descaras like sleep like not sleeping but resting on on one on, on the other tail covered that what well, that's funny the art like I said before beautiful beautiful art on page 12 the bottom panel where Ichi says oh interesting and it's just nice and sparkly it is really nice and I definitely like Ichi's mindset where he's like, Raikou, he was he was just killing for no reason. He says, it wasn't hungry. Its life wasn't in danger. It burned other creatures purely because it felt like it. 
that isn't hunting, that's murder. It had no problem toying with others, thus it has no right to complain about others toying with it. I definitely like when Ichi gets serious because he's a hunter. He hunts for food, right? He grew up in the mountains. He was abandoned as a kid. So hunting, taking a life for him means survival. When he sees other creatures not hunt, but just kill for no reason, it really rubs him the wrong way. And we see that in panels when he's seriously talking about stuff like that and his face is all serious. And I like that Ichi, you know, He's not just, oh, he's a happy-go-lucky guy all the time. No, he, he can get serious as well. Yes, he's goofy at times, which is good. And I really like that about his character. Ichi is a great character. And even in this chapter, he didn't have to utilize Uroro like the Skaraz told him when they were making the plan to infuse magic into the rope. And definitely shows his skill as a hunter. We also learned that after taking down a magic, they drop this gem. And the gem has the incantation you could chant to use their power, basically. So that was really interesting to see. And then at the end of the chapter, we see them going to the Mantino Witches Association. And yeah, that was the end of the chapter. The scour says something in the chapter like, oh, Ichi will be very popular with the other witches because of how he d does things, how he basically can take down the magic without, I'm not going to say without using magic because the rope has mag magic infused, but, you know, without using his power fully, right? Because, you know, even in the chapter, <laughs> they were mentioning, oh, um, Uroro was like, oh, isn't it supposed to be a grandiose battle, the witch and the magic face to face, like a really epic battle? But no, Ichi's like, no, I'm, I'm going to use my brain and, and plan with the scars and we're going to capture this electric magic. Overall, another good chapter from Ichi the Witch. I enjoyed it. I'm going to give this one a 7 out of 10. Peace.